And every day I get a little bit older and you know these guys we bring in new young guys each year but um, just trying to trying to stay uh, active as much as I can out there and you know take care of my body as much as I can and you know every day the start of camp was the best you're gonna feel the whole season through so uh, just taking it one day at a time really yeah uh, how, do, how do you feel about the line this year I know last year people were pretty excited and then you know the production wasn't there but sure man I mean everyone seems to be pretty bullish about this, this group yeah uh, I think it's a different group in terms of mentality and stuff like yeah. that. You know, I last year was just a little bit different. We had a different amount of guys and group of guys, and also the younger guys weren't as uh, be, they weren't as able to be young. Honestly, you know, we always say that the, the line last year was young and didn't have a lot of experience or anything like that. But at the same time, I think it's just a growing year. It's a transition year, and uh, you know, we're focused on this year and what we can do. And I'm really excited for it. You know, I've, I've loved hanging out with these guys. Everyone in the room is totally committed to, you know, getting better each and every day. Today was one of our better practices we've had. So, um, yeah, it's just one day at a time, really, with these guys. And uh, everyone's definitely understanding, you know, what we have to accomplish this year and what, what that takes. What, uh, what do you need to do better as a group? Uh, you know, I think... I think it's more togetherness and at the same time just being on the same page with each other. I think sometimes last year we, you know, saw a funky front or something like that or maybe lined up against somebody and, you know, thought I was completely one on one when at the same time, you know, you have four other guys lined up next to you who can help you out. And um, yeah, I think just at the end of the day, it's just being more together. And we've done a good job of that. We've just helped our team chemistry and offensive line chemistry at the same time. So it's been really good for us this season. How, was, uh, how, would, how did Barnett deal with? everything last year you know young guys didn't have as much success as he wanted but I'm, he seems like such a positive guy I guess. Yeah. I'm just curious we don't get to be in there so tell me how he dealt with kind of the ups and downs I guess of the line sure yeah I mean he's media trained really well so I'm sure he looks positive around you guys a lot of the time <laughs> uh you know there's some reps where he's yelling at us but yeah. um you know he cares a lot I think that's the one thing and last year he was just as invested as he was this year um, and that number just keeps rising each and every day and each and every week he gets to be out there with us he's, He always tells us he's proud of us and you know each and every day It's there's some, there's always something good and something bad. It's never as good as you think It's never as bad as you think but uh, you know with coach Fournette, you know You always got someone in your corner to back yeah. you up and he's representing us really well at this at this moment in time So you now I appreciate him as a coach and all he's done for me. So